Hello everybody. Today we're gonna to be going over the business and self-employed or freelancer resources. I built a document together with my company, Invents Labs, to provide all of the documentation that you would need as a business to apply for loans, to apply for grants, and if you're self-employed, how to go about the process of filing for unemployment in your own state. So this is something that we're helping our freelancers with and we wanted to share it with you all. So enjoy the video and let us know if you have any questions in the comments below. All right guys, so today I wanna to show you guys how to access the business and freelancer resources that we have created at Invents Labs in order to support those businesses that are suffering from the COVID impact and also the freelancers and self-employed individuals that are suffering and, and needing to get a paycheck. So this particularly pertains to those businesses and individuals that are living in the United States uh, but certainly there's grants and other options available to internationals around the world. So uh, please ask any questions or uh, place any comments or suggestions in the comment section below so we can figure out how to best collect this information and put it in one central location. I know a lot of other companies are doing this. Um, some of them I've, I've grabbed information from there and tried to give the respect and the credit to them. So you'll see some other companies' names in here because of that. So on the Invents Labs homepage, this is inventslabs.com, you can see a bar banner at the top, uh, which is Access COVID-19 Business and Freelancer Resources. I'll also leave a link to our website in the description. But if you click on this, it'll open into a Google Doc. Now, if you don't already have access to the Google Doc, just to be completely transparent, this is a way that we're gathering email addresses. So we ask you that you just provide your email and then we'll give you access to the uh, document. If you do not want to give your email away, we totally understand. Uh, just put a comment in the comment section below asking for a PDF copy and we'll give you a link to download one. Uh, just keep in mind that the PDF copy is not constantly updated. So the Google Doc is and that's the benefit of exchanging your email for us. It helps us grow our email list and we're providing all of the access to the resources. So this will just take you through the different sections that we have here. I'm releasing some news items here and then we have some resource links for individuals and self-employed self people. And then underneath page two, we have business resources. So if you scroll all the way down to business resources, you'll see some uh, documents that we've linked some how to access financing and access to capital, uh, US Small Business Association, SBA.gov, and all of the different resources that they have there. So this is the exact way that I filed for unemployment as myself. I'm a uh, sole proprietor and owner of an LLC, and I followed the pandemic unemployment assistance. Now, currently I'm residing in North Carolina, so I followed the North Carolina's system. I don't know too much how the uh, different states are setting up their platforms, but I imagine it's roughly the same. So the main premise that I wanna communicate is for the self-employed individuals on this document, we're talking about applying for unemployment for yourself as your own employer. And the biggest thing that they told me on the phone was you need to create an individual account, so not a business account, and you'd only create a business account if you have W-2 employees. So if you create your own individual account, if you're self-employed, then you're gonna use your first and last name as your individual business account. So what I mean by that is when you're filing for this unemployment, you'll see a section that says name your employer. And the name of your employer is self-employed and then first name, last name. So that's what you wanna do and follow these steps and if you haven't already please read the how to establish your freelancer profile i'll do another video about this in the future but part of what we do at invents labs is train freelancers how to become more proficient to navigate the uh, gig economy and so what we're doing is trying to help you establish a clear path to get from individual to freelancer to full formed organization with a team and you started by freelancing. So that's the idea is to help you become more and more profitable doing what you love. And so definitely check out these resources, check out the information on our homepage at inventslabs.com. And if you have any questions, like I said, put them in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching.